are continuing to track a strong storm that is pushing now from Kiowa County into northern Prowers County. The severe thunderstorm warning was allowed to expire at 1030, but as this storm drops off toward the south, Highway 50 between Lamar and Holly could end up with some pretty heavy rain and even some small hail. We'll keep an eye on that for you here as we head through the rest of the night. Elsewhere in southern Colorado, things are looking pretty quiet. Skycast is showing that that strong storm out near the eastern plains, that is going to come to an end as we head into your early Wednesday morning. Plenty of sunshine once again expected to start you off early tomorrow and we'll keep the sun around through about lunchtime. By 1 o'clock though, clouds will begin to thicken. We'll start to see our first signs of showers and thunderstorms over the southern mountains and then as we take you into the later afternoon, we'll get a few more spotty storms along the I-25 corridor. Focus in on this area out near Burlington though. That's where we'll have the potential for some of the strongest storms. Those storms dropping to the south once again through 7 o'clock. Notice all of the activity really out across the plains with not a whole lot going on along the I-25 corridor. And we may keep storms out across the plains through midnight tomorrow night. So it may end up being a little bit more active as we head into the later hours tomorrow, especially near the Colorado-Kansas state line. Stick with us. We'll track those storms for you. We'll keep you ahead of them. Taking a look at temperatures tonight, we'll drop it into the 50s and 60s. High temperatures tomorrow, we are back in the 80s and 90s. May end up being a few degrees warmer tomorrow than it even was out there today. 89 degrees tomorrow in Colorado Springs, 86 on Thursday. Temperatures staying for the most part in the mid to upper 80s with the exception of Sunday when we'll hit 90 degrees. A daily chance for storms, though, expected into early next week. In Pueblo tomorrow, 96, 95. Then on Thursday, a 10% chance for storms through Saturday, a 20% chance Sunday into Monday. Day. In Canyon City, tomorrow we hit 94, then 93 on Thursday. We'll spend the weekend in the mid 90s with a daily chance for afternoon thunderstorms. And again, in Teller County, 79 degrees tomorrow, 78 then on Thursday with a 20 to 30 percent chance for storms as we head into early next week. You guys remember this video that we showed yesterday? This is of a gusnado that was shot in Avondale. And a lot of people said, oh, it's a tornado. It's actually a gust tornado. So if you're interested in learning a little bit more about yeah. what that is, I have put together a write up on the explanation on how those form and how they're different than tornadoes. You can find that over on caredio.com. Oh, nice. A little science lesson for yeah, you. Yeah, I love yeah. it. Thanks, Thanks yeah, Rachel. Well, still to come here on Caredio News Channel 13 at 10, he brought a water pistol to a gunfight. Yeah.